friends and our guest speaker and the first of the dashavatara because there are ten evaluators but i'm sure you're going to enjoy this experience because in your speech the positives certainly outweigh the areas for improvement i can surely say that you try to reach the crescendo of excellence in the three Vs of public speaking, visual, vocal, verbal. When you imitated Carol, you had the vocal variety. When you panted, you had the vocal variety. Of course, when it came to even action, you coupled vocal variety with the visual impact of Carol's coy look. And when it came to the verbal aspect, you had so many analogies. You had the twist of the jalebi. You had ice cream in a building on fire. You had an investor trying to pull himself out of a crash in the stock market. Those analogies were all heartwarming. And you did it in a very Indian setup. And you endeared you to me because of that Indian setup. And in the vocal variety, it was not just the vocal variety in the traditional sense, but it is in the very style of those characters speaking. And when you had so many characters in your speech, I was reminded of this, your stage, your story. You had a story with a beautiful plot and you had those characters coming to life with your narrative and with your descriptive quality. Now, I felt the best part of your speech was that you had a complete circle. You started with a ladder and you ended with a ladder and you gave yourself the scope of even climbing on to the escalator. But do I have any suggestions for improvement? Did you pant? Did you ask for oxygen cylinders as you tried to climb the height of the peak? I felt at times probably because when you come up with a rhetorical question, it's a good beginning. But then don't ever wait because the rhetorical question is only for an impact and don't wait for the audience to come up with any kind of response. And I also felt that when you had like a snake climbing up like a snake, it was not the movement, the sluggish movement of a snake. But more importantly, intellectual stamina gives you a more speech value in a speech that emotional quotient coupled with a little more of intellectual stamina bringing to the focus that life has so much to give you but you have to choose. Finally, I felt in conclusion, I must say that I would have given you a straight entry to Hall of Fame of Gold, but you took eight minutes. So it is Hall of Fame bronze to you, Test Speaker. Back to you, Contest Toastmaster.